thousands of customers way too much when it rolled out a new computer billing system. As CBS 2's Randy Page tells us, some customers are facing very high bills. Thank you for calling your Los Angeles Department of Water and Power. Have you ever found yourself lost in the netherworld of telephone phone trees? Say English or press one. For Christiane Lima, the stakes are high. The L.A. Department of Water and Power wants her to pay them $29,536. We record all conversations. Okay, um, I'm going to record the conversation too, okay? Consumer Watchdog of Santa Monica did the recording as Lima continues her two-year battle trying to convince the DWP she doesn't owe anywhere near $29,000. It looks like they found that the bills are correct, ma'am. Christiani Lima owns a small martial arts studio in Torrance. She says it's open just six hours a day, and she doesn't use air conditioning. The fluorescent lights and a couple of drink machines are about the only electric fixtures she uses. Her monthly bill was normally about $250, but a couple of years ago, it suddenly shot up to 10 times that much. Let me ask you to hold just a moment. The phone call lasted more than 30 minutes. She was told the investigation into her bills is complete, and she owed the entire $29,000, or her power would be shut off. The only way I can stop that, that shut off of service is to make an arrangement. What kind of arrangement? 20% one week from today, then we can do six months on the ballot. We asked the DWP to examine Lima's bill and to explain why it jumped exactly 10 times the amount from one month to the next. There was a human error entered into the system where they added a zero, so essentially added a factor of 10 to her billing factor. One ratepayer with a successful resolution. Many others still waiting.